I'm Tony Stumpo, and these are your top 10 plays for the fall semester 2022. Coming in at number 10 is number 11 for the Spartans, Barry Butler. He's going to pump fake, retreat, return fire, and boom, headshot on number 44, Jacob Weber of Cincinnati. This was an early season showdown that would eventually catapult Michigan State into the number one spot where they have remained since then. Number nine is another headshot, this time coming from Ohio University's Terrence Checkett, taking out JMU's James Turner. JMU would go on to win the match 4-3 to three in overtime, but Terrence got the better of this exchange. Number eight gives us a little bit of teamwork here, courtesy of the Falcons out of EGSU. First, Kalen Strother misses the catch, but his teammate came in Klein is right there, Johnny on the spot for the catch, who says, well, hey, I failed you out and caught the ball. I'm going to go ahead and keep it here. I'm going to make the throw. Meanwhile, return fire comes from his opponent. He gets blown up, but nope. Kalen Strother there to bail him out, says, thanks, homie. I took care of you. You take care of me. Let's go. Nice teamwork there by the Falcons. At number seven on our list is MVP frontrunner Jack Gerling, just with a devastating headshot there on the UWP Pioneer player. Nice throw from Gerling, and even the ref has a look to say, Phew, better you than me. Number six on our list comes to us courtesy of Ethan Lemkul of Ohio State University. Gets hit on the knee, the ball pops up. Great concentration right here to stick with it. Lays out, makes the catch while simultaneously dodging two cross throws. Number five on our list takes us back to the same match that we saw number 10 come from, and that's going to be Jacob Weber with a big headshot here against Michigan State University, avenging his from earlier. All Jack Gerling and Barry Butler can do now is look on. Number four comes to us from a bit of a lopsided affair between Ohio and Kentucky, but don't tell that to Robert Bennett, who's still playing hard all the way through the whistle and comes up with a beautiful double catch on the Ohio team throw there. Number three takes us back to an early season event at Miami of Ohio. In overtime of a back and forth game, PJ Antelin goes back to back with the kills, ending it with a mean face shot on Tyler Webb of the Falcons to cap off the overtime victory for the Zips. Number two on our list takes us back to the John Betters Bobcat Bonanza three. A missed line violation leads to a great double catch in the corner by the Clay Eggleston. Beautiful play here. Ohio State would go on to win this one four to one, however. You can see the look of disbelief on the Ohio State players. Number one on the countdown sends us all the way back to the first tournament of the year at the Buckeye Showcase. Terrence Checka, who was on our list earlier at number nine, is unfortunately gonna play a supporting role in this one as he winds up and throws over at senior Ryan Ginsburg, who shows great concentration and not only stay in bounds, but stick with the play and make the catch for the Buckeyes. Ohio would eventually come back from down 3-0 and win this one 4-3 though. Now we'll conclude our top 10 plays for this fall semester 2022. If you think you've got what it takes to make a top 10 play, Form a team at your school today. Contact us at the information provided.